street sweeper going to the city of Laverne. This is like a uh, demo unit, so there was a few companies using it down here in the valley. It's time for it to go back to its uh, to the owner, so we're gonna go ahead and take it up to Laverne, up to the rental agency or the um, the dealership, I guess you could say, and uh, deliver it. So Darl went ahead and preloaded this yesterday, so we're just gonna go ahead and check, make sure all of our chains are tight, uh, no you know loose chains or anything like that. Now it's tight, comfortable with that. Darl also put a strap across these brushes here because the brushes can uh, slide out when you take a turn if they don't have air pressure or something like that. Hasn't happened to me, but Darl said it's happened to him. So he put a strap there and we got a chain here, another chain over there, and the same thing on the back side. We got a full tank of fuel, full tank of death. So let's go ahead and head to Laverne and enjoy the ride. picture for a thumbnail. Thank <laughs> you. 
drop off here. Call you back here in a few minutes. Yeah, I'm unloading right now. Right. That was Darl. He's moving that uh, big excavator again right now. All right, let's go ahead and level this thing out or put it down, I guess. safety on just in case break I don't know just to just in case process I believe on how to do that detailed right before it got returned I believe because there's like like armor all almost on the handles and stuff like that it's all slippery all right let's go and start her up there we go make sure we need air pressure to bring everything up so we'll let the 
air pressure build up a little bit. check in with these guys and then I'll see you back at the trailer all right guys we dropped off the uh, sweeper there so now we'll just uh, use our handy remote